The Bichuanaland Protectorate was a protectorate established on 31 March 1885, by the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Ireland in southern Africa. It became the Republic of Botswana on 30 September 1966. History Scottish missionary John Mackenzie (1835–99), a Congregationalist of the London Missionary Society (LMS), who lived at Shoshong from 1862 to 76, believed that the Nguato and other African peoples with whom he worked were threatened by Boer freebooters encroaching on their territory from the south. He campaigned for the establishment of what became the Bichuanaland Protectorate, to be ruled directly from Britain. Austral Africa, losing it or ruling it is Mackenzie's account of events leading to the establishment of the Protectorate. Influenced by Mackenzie, in January 1885 the British cabinet decided to send a military expedition to South Africa to assert British sovereignty over the contested territory. Sir Charles Warren led a force of 4,000 imperial troops north from Cape Town. After making treaties with several African chiefs, Warren announced the establishment of the Protectorate in March 1885. Mackenzie accompanied Warren, and Austral Africa contains a detailed account of the expedition. Bichuanaland meant the country of the Sawana and for administrative purposes was divided into two political entities. The northern part was administered as the Bichuanaland Protectorate and the southern part was administered as the Crown Colony of British Bichuanaland. British Bichuanaland was incorporated into the Cape Colony in 1895 and now forms part of South Africa. The northern part, the Bichuanaland Protectorate, had an area of 225,000 square miles, 580,000 square kilometers, and a population of 120,776. The British government originally expected to turn over administration of the Protectorate to Rhodesia or South Africa, but Sawana opposition left the Protectorate under British rule until its independence in 1966. The Bichuanaland Protectorate was technically a protectorate rather than a colony. Originally the local Sawana rulers were left in power, and British administration was limited to a police force to protect Bichuanaland's borders against other European colonial ventures. But on 9 May 1891 the British government gave the administration of the Protectorate to the High Commissioner for South Africa, who started to appoint officials in Bichuanaland, and the de facto independence of Bichuanaland ended. The Protectorate was administered from Mafeking, creating an unusual situation, the capital of the territory being located outside of the territory. The area of Mafeking from 1980 with the incorporation into Bofuthotswana Mafeking, since 2010 Mahakeng, was called the Imperial Reserve. In 1885, when the Protectorate was declared, Bichuanaland was bounded to the north by the latitude of 22 degrees south. The northern boundary of the Protectorate was formally extended northward by the British to include Namiland, which was then dominated by the Tawana state, on 30 June 1890. This claim was formally recognized by Germany the following day by Article 3 of the Heligoland Zanzibar Treaty, which confirmed the western boundary of the British Protectorate of Bichuanaland and the German Protectorate of Southwest Africa and also created the Caprivi Strip inherited by modern Namibia. Then, in Southwest Africa, Germany's sphere of influence is demarcated thus to the south by the line that commences at the mouth of the Orange River and continues up its northern bank to its intersection point with the 20 degrees east longitude. To the east by the line that commences at the aforementioned point and follows the 20th degree of east longitude to its intersection point with the 22 degrees south latitude. The line then traces this degree of latitude eastward to its intersection with the 21 degrees east longitude, follows this degree of longitude northward to its intersection with the 18 degrees south latitude, runs along this degree of latitude eastward to its intersection with the Chobe River. Here it descends the Thalweg of the main channel until it meets the Zambezi, where it ends. It is understood that under this arrangement Germany shall be granted free access from its protectorate to the Zambezi by means of a strip of land not less than 20 English miles wide at any point. Great Britain's sphere of influence is bounded to the west and northwest by the previously described line and includes Lake Gami. British officials did not arrive in the Namiland region until 1894. The Tati Concessions Land Act of the 21st of January 1911 transferred New Eastern Territory to the protectorate. 
from the place where the Shashay River rises to its junction with the Tati and Ramukgwebana rivers, thence along the Ramukgwebana River to where it rises and thence along the watershed of those rivers. This territory was originally claimed by Matabeliland. In 1887 Samuel Edwards, working for Cecil Rhodes, obtained a mining concession, and in 1895 the British South Africa Company attempted to acquire the area, but three Sawana chiefs visited London to protest and were successful in fending off the BSAC. This territory forms the modern northeast district of Botswana. Politics The most powerful ruler was King Kama III, who had strong support from the British government, and was especially popular among evangelicals in Britain. He collaborated closely with the British military, and kept his vast, but underpopulated lands independent from intruders from South Africa. Kama's eldest son, Sekoma II, became chief of the Bamangwato upon Kama's death in 1923. Sekoma II's eldest son was named Seretsi. Throughout his life, Kama was widowed and remarried several times. One wife, Saman, birthed a son named Shakiti. Sekoma II's reign lasted only a year or so, leaving his son Seretsi, who at the time was an infant, as the rightful heir to the chieftainship. Shakiti was not in line to be chief since he did not descend from Kama's oldest son Sekoma II. So, in keeping with tradition, Shakiti acted as regent of the tribe until Seretsi was old enough to assume the chieftainship. The transfer of responsibility from Shakiti to Seretsi was planned to occur after Seretsi had returned from his law studies overseas in Britain. Shakiti's regency as acting chief of the Bamangwato is best remembered for his expansion of the Mafato regiments to build primary schools, grain silos, and water reticulation systems, for his frequent confrontations with the British colonial authorities over the administration of justice in Nguato country, and for his efforts to deal with a major split in the tribe after Seretsi married a white woman, Ruth Williams, while studying law in Britain. Shakiti opposed the marriage on the grounds that under Sawana custom a chief could not marry simply as he pleased. He was a servant of the people, the chieftaincy itself was at stake. Seretsi would not budge in his desire to marry Ruth, and he did, while exiled in Britain in 1948. Tribal opinion about the marriage basically split evenly along demographic lines, older people went with Shakiti, the younger with Seretsi. In the end, British authorities exiled both men Shakiti from the Bamangwato territory, Seretsi from the protectorate altogether. Rioting broke out and a number of people were killed. Seretsi and Ruth were allowed to return to the protectorate and Seretsi and Shakiti were able to patch things up a bit between themselves. By now though, Seretsi saw his destiny not as chief of the Bamangwato tribe, but rather as leader of the Botswana Democratic Party and as president of the soon-to-be independent nation of Botswana in 1966. He would remain Botswana's president until his death from pancreatic cancer in 1980. The story of Seretsi and Ruth forms the basis of the 2016 film A United Kingdom. Topic commissioners The Bichwanaland Protectorate was one of the High Commission territories, the others being Basitoland now Lesotho, and Swaziland. The High Commissioner had the authority of a governor. The office was first held by the Governor of the Cape Colony, then by the Governor-General of South Africa, then by British High Commissioners and Ambassadors to South Africa until independence. Consequently, administration was headed in each territory by a resident commissioner, who thus had approximately the same functions of a governor but somewhat less authority. Topic justice The Chief Justice was the Chief Justice of the High Commission Territories Basitoland, Bichwanaland Protectorate and Swaziland. From 1951 the Chief Justices were, topic postage stamps Bichwanaland postage stamps were issued from 1888 to 1966. Overprinted stamps were issued until 1932, when the first stamps inscribed Bichwanaland Protectorate were issued. On 14 February 1961 the South African Rand was introduced, necessitating the surcharging of the existing definitive stamps until new ones were issued. Topic gallery of postage stamps Postage stamps Pictures Topic Revenue stamps for British Bichwanaland Topic Broadcasting in Bichwanaland Topic See also History of Botswana British Bichwanaland, the area south of the Molopo River, now part of South Africa. Topic notes Topic Further reading TLOU, Thomas, Campbell, Alexander C. 1997. History of Botswana 2nd ed. Gaborone, Botswana, Macmillan Botswana. ISBN 978-99912-78-08-7. Harrigan, Walter et al. 
Report of the Judicial Enquiry Re Suretsi Kama of the Bamangwado Tribe, the 1st of December 1949, reproduced in Botswana Notes and Records, Volume 17, 1985, pp. 53 to 64. Parsons, Neil. New History of Southern Africa. Topic external links. Bechwana Canteen Token Coin History of Botswana. List of Bichwanaland Colonial Administrators. Bibliography for Botswana History texts on Wikisource, Bichwanaland. New International Encyclopedia, 1905. Beshwanaland. The Nuttall Encyclopedia, 1907. Bichwanaland. Encyclopedia Britannica, 11th ed., 1911. Beach, Chandler B., ed., 1914. Bichwanaland. The New Students' Reference Work. Chicago, F.E. Compton & Co. Bichwanaland Protectorate, The. The New Students' Reference Work, 1914. Bichwanaland. Collier's New Encyclopedia, 1921. Rhines, George Edwin, ed. 1920. Bichwanaland. Encyclopedia Americana. Bichwanaland Protectorate. Encyclopedia Americana, 1920.